Mitosis, when the cell splits apart. What is mitosis? Eventually, cells need to duplicate. There are two main methods of replication, mitosis and meiosis. This tutorial will talk about mitosis. The big idea to remember is that mitosis is the simple duplication of a cell and all its parts. It duplicates its DNA and the two new cells, daughter cells, have the same pieces and genetic code. Two identical copies come from one original. Beyond the idea that two identical cells are created, there are certain steps in the process. Before a cell divides, it is in resting phase. The cell in resting phase is not actually resting, since it has to maintain its reservoir before it undergoes division. This phase is called interphase. It prepares the cell for division, i.e. protein synthesis, DNA duplication, and enzymes. After this phase comes mitosis, which is further divided into karyokinesis, division of nucleus, and cytokinesis, division of cytoplasm. Karyokinesis involves the four basic steps of mitosis that are prophase, metaphase, anaphase, telophase. Here we start with prophase. The chromosomes start coiling and become condensed. Nuclear envelope disintegrates. Gene transcription ceases during prophase and does not resume until late anaphase to early G1 phase. The nucleolus also disappears during early prophase. Centrosome gives rise to mitotic apparatus, i.e. generation of spindle tubules. Metaphase. Now all the pieces are aligning themselves for the big split. The DNA lines up along a central axis, and the DNA, chromatin, has now condensed into chromosomes. Two strands of chromosome are connected at the center of the centromere. The tubules connect to the centromere, not the DNA. Anaphase. Here we go. The separation begins. Half of the chromosomes are pulled to one side of the cell. Half go the other way. When the chromosomes get to the side of the cell, it's time to move on to telophase. Telophase. Now the division is finishing up. This is the time when the nuclear envelope begins to synthesize again along the separated chromosomes. Cytokinesis pinches the cell membrane in the middle. Cell membrane closes in and splits the cell into two. Now we have two separate cells, each with half of the original DNA. Up till now, we have discussed what is mitosis and its different phases. Now it's important to know about significance of mitosis. Significance. It is an equational division through which identical daughter cells are produced, having the same amount and type of genetic constitution as that of the parent cell. It is responsible for growth and development of multicellular organisms from a single cell zygote. The number of chromosomes remains the same in all cells produced by this division. Thus, the daughter cells retain the same character as those of the parent cell. It helps the cell in maintaining proper size. Mitosis helps in restoring wear and tear in body tissues, replacement of damaged or lost part, healing of wounds and regeneration of detached parts. As in the tail of lizards, it is a method of multiplication in unicellular organisms. If mitosis remains unchecked, it may result in uncontrolled growth of cells, leading to cancer or tumor. The next important phase of cell cycle is meiosis.